So unfortunately, a recession is baked into the cake. And a primary reason for this is because prices remain elevated. Prices remain elevated for rents. Prices remain elevated for food. If you look at the CPI categories, food at home, food away from home, those numbers continue to tick up. And if you regularly read our Tech Today publication, you know that we believe that CPI is understated. So simply because the rate of increase in these categories in terms of the price increases is slowing, it doesn't mean that prices have gone negative. Prices, in fact, are still climbing. And we've had enormous price increases since the second half of 2020, particularly in categories like food, which greatly impacts the consumer day to day, week to week, month to month. So this will be a hard landing. It's not going to be a soft landing. It's not going to be a no landing scenario. We will experience a hard landing. And if you read Tech Today, you know that we believe that we've been in a recession uh, for months. Frankly, I believe all of 2023, we've been in a, a recession and that the reason why GDP is positive, uh, the real GDP readings, are because of the fact that true price increases are not backed out of that real GDP reading. In other words, the GDP deflator is understated. So we're not selling more units across the economy. It's just that prices have increased. 